Today we have Jen McRobert, the representative of Everything Equine and the event administrator at the Lloyd X, and she is here today to talk to us about the Everything Equine event and some special announcements you guys had. And so thank you so much for being with us today, Jen. Thanks for having me. And so Jen, tell us a little bit about this very special guest that is coming to your second ever Everything Equine event. Yeah, absolutely. So she is a world-renowned paraplegic barrel racer. Uh, her name is Amberly Snyder. She has her own movie called Walk, Ride, Rodeo, and it's about her story on how she competed before her accident, then she had her tragic accident that did leave her paralyzed from the waist down, and her uh, recovery and how she got back to competing in rodeo, barrel racing, and getting back to as much normal as she possibly could. And so tell me a little bit about what she's going to be doing at the Everything Equine event and a little bit about kind of what your guys' plans are for the weekend of the Everything Equine. Yeah, absolutely. So we will have Amberly Snyder on the Saturday, which would be the 15th of April. She will be doing a mental prep talk on how she kind of gets geared up to start competing uh, and her mindset before she goes into the show. And then on Saturday night, we'll be hosting a banquet and she will be doing a keynote speak a uh, speaking session on her story from tragedy to triumph and everything in between. And then on Sunday, you will have an opportunity to do a meet and greet where you can get an autograph and a photo with her. Okay, excellent. And then tell me a little bit about your guys' trainers challenge and the other things that you guys will be running throughout the weekend of Everything Equine as well. Yeah, absolutely. So last year we had uh, Cade Mills was our champion. He will be returning this year to uh, defend his champion title for the trainer challenge. And then we also have two other trainers joining him. Uh, we haven't released their names quite yet, so we'll get on to that. Uh, check on our website for any updates on that. And then we have three clinicians as well. We'll have a working cow horse, a working equitation, and then a youth 4-H uh, horsemanship uh, clinic as well. So we're very excited to have those. The very popular uh, fashion show last year has also making a return this year. So we will ha be hosting that, I believe, on Friday at noon. And uh, yeah, we'll have a dummy roping contest for kids this year as well. And yeah, it's going to be a great, great show. And then last year, you guys were looking for some horses to uh, be able to be trained. Are you guys opening that up once again for people to, if they have a horse that you guys can use for those trainers challenges or any other? And about if people would like to be part of the more specific training aspects, how do they sign up for that? Yeah, absolutely. So we already have the horses selected for the trainer challenge uh, that's done through a private contract. If you would like to participate in the clinics with your horse, there will be applications opening here in the next week or so. Uh, all the details will be on our website and keep uh, an eye on our social media because that's where we'll make our announcement when applications are open. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much for all the information, Jen. That's going to be in April, Everything Equine. If you'd like to get your horse trained, be sure to look out for those applications coming up soon.